Rossi here, and this is your Trib Live take for the week. We're upon hockey season already, believe it or not, and the Penguins are looking to get back into the good graces of NHL officials because they think they're going to have a power play that is going to light up the league. But I'm here to tell you, hold your thoughts on that right now because the Penguins have yet to show that they have anybody that can distribute that puck. And that's going to be a big thing for this power play. Yes, you've added Phil Kessel and you have of getting Malkin and Sidney Crosby and you have a mix of Patrick Hornfist and Chris Kunitz to be the net front guys. But what you don't have right now is a proven puck distributor on that unit. And it's a problem because Chris Letang has never shown that is his great skill. Now, you need to have Latang on the ice, unfortunately, for the Penguins because he's the best guy to carry the puck into the zone on that power play. And if you look at this Penguins defense core, and as young as it is and as lacking as it is in physicality, you would have to think that early in this season, head coach Mike Johnson wants the power play to be a dominant unit. It was that way for the first six weeks last season, clicking at around 40%. The Penguins hadn't had that success last season. They probably missed the playoffs. So what you want to look for early for these Penguins is can they figure out a way to get somebody to move the puck on the power play to guys like Kessel, guys like Crosby, guys like Malkin. If they can't, then it could be a really rough start for the Penguins who are looking to form an identity early in this NHL season. I don't have them making the playoffs this year. Let us know what you think anytime. TribLive.com. I'm Rob Rossi, Tribune Review Sports Columnist.